Hi, this is Psychic Medium Victoria Alvarado, and I wanted to do something different for the men. These are for the males only. Okay, I just did a video for ladies only, so now it's time for the guys. Okay, so I want to describe your next lover. I want to use these cards to show just uh, specific uh, characteristics, and uh, let's see what Spirit has to say. All right, so I've already picked out the cards, or the cards fell off, or you already shuffled them. So Spirit's telling me that we're getting two different air signs when it comes to the females. What's very funny is that they both kind of have some of the same characteristics, okay? One of them is an air sign. We're picking up Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. But because of the fact we're going into the month of October, I kind of feel like there's something with the Scorpio. I feel like this is something that you gentlemen are gonna be meeting this woman around this time in October. For some reason, Spirit is saying that the woman that you're about to meet is basically work-related. So she may work with you or you may do some work or something with her. Now, Spirit is saying that this woman is either black or African-American or multiracial. And it's very funny because Spirit also said Hawaiian. And of course, this kind of all kind of fits together a little bit, you know? Um, so it, it could be either or, either they may just be black, African American, or this person is multiracial and got, or either is Hawaiian, okay? Let me just say this, that one of them is darker skinned, and they're describing the other person has more olive, medium, or dark skinned as well. So it's almost like both these people, these, these women's characteristics kind of run together a little bit. Both are very genuine and very sincere. They're both very spiritual, okay? One of them has more curly hair. Um, the other one has more longer hair. It is either wavy, braided, straight, or she just kind of wears loose curls, okay? Now, the initials that I'm getting for these ladies are B, E, J, Y, R, W, or U. All right. Now, both women are great cooks, you know, they're a badass in the kitchen, you know, they have a different ethnic background, and that goes to what fell out with the cards, you know, earlier about what I was describing, either they're multiracial or Hawaiian or black African American. This person may also um, own their own restaurant or they are working in the culinary field, but Again, it's very interesting when they say this because I'm looking at the career and they're saying that this woman, these women, both of them are very creative. They're either an artist, sports, they're into sports, they're stylists, they're into fitness, they're uh, into spiritual uh, spirituality, they said spiritual, they might do work in marketing or something with the community or event planner. And again, the cooking thing, both of them kind of resonate because of the fact that this person may be in the culinary field and the event planner thing kind of like strikes something with me for some reason. Now, this both women have very strong sex appeal. Uh, they're sexy, they're attractive, they're irresistible. Uh, both of them are kind of slim, thick, so they have they have they're very fit. They have a flat stomach, you know, small waist, very shapely. Now, when it comes to these women, they are very family oriented. They do and uh, they do want a partnership. They do want a higher commitment. They do want to have children. I don't pick up children for neither one of them, but I can say that, you know, um, both resonate for either one of them. For some reason, I kind of feel that one of them has colored eyes, one is, has green eyes. They both might, especially if they're multiracial, either one of these ladies are Hawaiian, but it feels like maybe they may just have, uh, what they may want your contacts or something. Both of them are very trendy. One may one of them may like to wear wigs. One of them may like to wear heels, or they're very casual or very dressy. Whatever it is, they're very with the trend. Okay. Now I can tell you, gentlemen, that it's going to be a very slow start, but you're going to have to give it time when you meet this person. Because, like I said, I feel October. Um, as far as the facial features are concerned, they're telling me that one of them has more like a straight pointy type nose. They may have had work done on their nose. And the other one has more of a conclave nose. You're going to have to Google that one so you can fully understand what a conclave nose looks like. Now, this person, let me tell you something, guys. 
if either of these women, like I said, they all have, they both have characteristics, but they're describing two different women here. And both of them want marriage, okay? One of them feels like they've already been married before. Maybe they are a mother themselves. The other one may not be a mom, but she wants children. She wants a higher commitment. But I can tell you right now, they have money. They have, uh, they drive luxury cars, or they have houses. They may have a house of their own. You know, but they're pretty independent is what I'm picking up on, guys, that I'm seeing. And again, I said the air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And as I said before, they also talked about water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But the Scorpio, Scorpio really popped out to me because of the fact that we're moving into the month of Scorpio anyway in October. So it might be around the time frame when you're going to meet them. Um... This may also resonate for some of you males that are in the LGBTQ, okay? When it comes to, to that, I don't really type, do those type of readings, but I do get people that are in a part of the LGBTQ community. And so some of these features, or even just the, the zodiac signs may resonate with you. Again, this is Psychic Medium Victoria Alvarado. Um, trying something new to talk about your next lover and describe them. If this resonates with you or if you actually meet this person, please comment below and you have a nice night.